Hey everybody, I thought I'd do a quick video about the deals that I got this week. Um, I swore to my husband that I wouldn't be shopping as much, but apparently I'm not able to keep that promise. So anyway, I found um, chipboard at Michael's, the chipboard books, the five pages that I've seen in other people's videos, but I haven't been able to find them at Michael's until just now. Um, they had them marked down to 20 cents. So I was really excited to find those. Um, I just picked up four of them, but I should have got the whole, there are probably ten more, and I should have picked them all up. I didn't know they were only going to be 20 cents. So, and then also at Michael's, um, it's maybe not so much of a deal. I mean, I use my 40% off coupon in it, so it's great, but this, um, create a sticker. I used to have a, the big Xyron, and I actually sold it at a garage sale because I never used it, but now that I got the Cricut, I feel like I really would be able to use it, so... Instead of spending the, you know, $30, $30 or whatever on the big one, I thought I'd give this a try first because I don't do too many letters past the one and a half for my titles and things. So, anyway, for those, I thought I'd give this a try. And um, then I actually I sold something on Craigslist, which um, that's how I try and make some money for, especially baby items are really popular on Craigslist. So what I do are is during the summer sometimes I find things at garage sales marked really cheap and I'll turn around them and I'll sell them on Craigslist to make a profit off of it. So that helps kind of fund my shopping. So anyway, um, that's how I paid for most of this stuff. Well, then at Hobby Lobby, um, this wasn't on sale but I saw this on somebody's haul and I really, really wanted this. It's a little dress form and it's got a little fabric in it and stuff. I thought if I got one of those configuration boxes that this would be super cute for that. Um, I, I just like dress forms. I really want to get really a big one someday. But I thought that was neat. And then I got all the Tim Holtz stuff was on sale. It was 30% off. I really wanted a bicycle um, paper to go with. I showed you that Kane Company paper. I had picked up the Dreams one and it had some bicycles in it. And I actually made my brother a book a pocketbook out of out of that paper and this would have been really cute for that but I love I love these these stamps I like the car but I like this phrase too it says time is a companion that goes with us on the journey it reminds us to cherish each moment because it will never come again what we leave behind is not as important as how we have lived I love that that's that's really cool so I've been wanting a bicycle stamp and $14.99 and then 30% off so that wasn't too bad and then I got these Tim Holtz um, ornate book plates, and I thought these would be cool on my books too. And um, I picked up some more um, for my scrapbook store. They have a huge selection of bind it all stuff, and I picked up some one inch rings. And while I was there, I found this just a dress form chipboard. I guess it made it belong to a book or something once, but it was only 89 cents. And I wanted to use it as a template for something. So, and my big purchase for this week was my Martha Stewart uh, scoreboard. And I don't know how I got on without this because this is really awesome, especially now that I'm making books and things. This is, this is really nice. And it'll be nice for when I make cards and stuff. And my really good deal for the week is I sat to Tuesday morning and I found these stamp sets marked for $1.99 and they're by Elsie. These ones are forest and they're 36 pieces in it. I thought these were really cool. And these ones are Claire. And they're all alphabets. They're just different. This one's Cody. It looks like it's for baseball or something. And these are Josie. These are Daisy. Got a little paw print. And these are awesome. These are Roxy. My little dots all over them. And then these were a different company, but they were also $1.99 and a lot bigger. They're um, K1 Memories Alphabet Stamps or KI Memories Alphabet Stamps. And so for $1.99, and I looked, they said the original price was $9.99, but I found these online because I just wanted to see how much video I really got. And I saw them on some website for $17. 
So anyway, for $1.99, that's awesome. So, oh, and I did pick up, I had a $10 um, gift card to Target because I used the coupon. We had a new, filled a new prescription, and I used the coupon that was in the paper last Sunday for if you fill a new prescription, you get a $10 card. So I picked up this. Um, I was thinking about getting the ATG gun, um, but I thought I'd save up for that and do that another time because even with the 50% off came upon it'd be $20. And I don't know how much I really am going to like using such a big thing, but this has 49 feet in it. And it was $7.99, and if I use, you know, 50% off, 40% off coupon, it, it was $7.99 at Michael's too. But since I had the Target card, I went ahead and bought it there. So I'm hoping this works good. This is a dot roller. And I don't know how much I'm going to like the dots. I'm used to using this straight, so I don't know. We'll see how that works. And I also did pick up some, at Michael's, some embossing powder, some black. I'm really new to embossing and new to stamping. Um, so... I know, I'm, I like, I've been using a clear emboss, like a kaleidoscope color or something. It just has glitter in it, and I like that. So I'm interested to see how this turns out. And if anybody has any um, suggestions on how, you know, any techniques or anything that they want to share, that'd be great. And also, if anybody is using um, their bind it all, I'd love to see your projects. So just, you know, if I'm missing some videos or something that you've done on the bind it with the bind it all, just post on my comments and let me know and I'll check out your site because I'm really interested to see what everybody else is making with their bind it all. So anyway, that's all I thought I'd share. Um, talk to you soon. Bye.